What is happening, everybody? Thank you very much for joining me. My name is John Denton. Listen, probably the most concentrated campaign of reaction requests I've ever had, certainly since the old Rock Reacts days, is for the new album by XO, Stablemate, Black Atlas, an artist that I've not heard yet. I know he's not necessarily a massive artist, so this reaction has been driven by you guys, and I'm happy to do it. I'm excited to do it, but I do need your help. So everybody who wanted to see this reaction, please jump on and give the video a like straight away. Can we get it sped up to sort of 2,000, 3,000 likes at the beginning? Likes definitely pushing videos out there. And the thing is, when it comes to views and all that sort of stuff, all I really care about is the people that want to watch the video and the people who might get something out of the video are able to watch the video. If we can get that out to the maximum amount of people that might want to see the video, then fantastic. That is literally what it's all about. Guys, if you're new as well, please do subscribe to the channel. I'm going to jump straight in with this Black Atlas album. Dream Awake, the way I've been sleeping, I kind of feel like that a lot of the time in this quarantine time. Hope you're all staying safe. Let's do this thing. Said I'm on worst than a Fake love and a sea next to me. Baby, I need your energy. Oh, straight away, beautiful voice on the guy. Somewhere between Abel and James Blake, almost. Really nice tone to his voice. Wow. Somehow it's never Yeah, amazing the way you can shift octaves like that. Really great technical singing. I like the song so far, it sounds really nice. You can definitely feel the emotion in what he's singing there. There's that beautiful line, I don't want to die in your eyes. Um, so that's, yeah, yeah, a strong bit of lyricism in an otherwise reasonably kind of standard sort of breakup, long-in type of track lyrically, but really soothing, just a beautiful voice and nice production. No, if I will even make it out alive, I guess that means it's still Stunning voice. This one's a little bit too poppy, a little bit too Owl City for me, I would say, just in terms of uh, the, the chord structure and the way that the song is put together, the kind of hand claps, um, the sound effect is, is never something that massively works for me and this is used in a really interesting way. Again, though, I do want to say his voice is stunning. The way he can shift octaves like that, the way he just slid up and down the scale like that, um, real nice to listen to. I've got no problem if it even stays like this throughout. I am hoping, given the quality of the voice and the fact he's on the XO, that we're going to get a little bit more, certainly a bit more sinister. But that's just me. Maybe it says more about me than anything else. Okay. I mean, the reason this sounds good is because it sounds almost exactly like a current weekend song. It sounds like something that would be on After Hours. Not quite the level of production. I'm not too sure if the hi-hats are working that well. If I'm being picky, if I'm being picky, but yeah, I mean, this sounds great, right? This is what I want to hear. Even if it just does sound like Abel, good. Chuck those hi-hats in the bin, and that's a great song. It's a really good song as it is, but Chuck those hi-hats in the bin are just annoying. 
but yeah, love that track. I'm still, I'm still love that track. like the guitar just hidden there in the background that's actually working for me again a little bit less intrusive with the uh, with the percussion again there I would have just liked something a little more a little less like unnecessarily trap influence because it doesn't really fit but I'm gonna try and stop concentrating on because I don't want this whole reaction to be about that I really want to focus on Black Atlas's tone on Black Atlas's melody and Black Atlas's flow I guess you over these uh, beats as a singer which is working really well this is another very very strong track again very reminiscent of Abel but that's fine Touchdown, I've come to collect. I just can't settle for love we just don't stop baby it's for us to take we don't fuck around we don't have no time to wait Use this pain I got lost, but it just happened that way. I just wanna fall in love. I don't care what they say. Don't tell me my eyes, we can never change. I like when the lights dance across your face. Very, 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 very good track. Okay. voice and tone is so good that it's carrying all these songs and they are good songs I just would love to hear him with better production it, it, I think he could be outstanding with better production this is an album I'm really enjoying okay sounds like we're going back into the pop bag on this one Yeah, this sounds like every song on the radio, but no bad thing. You gotta do some radio songs. But you got me seeing all the signs. Always looking for the same thing. Can I find baby? I can You in the right place at the right time. You in my life. Till we see the other side. Yeah, the song's absolutely fine. It is just totally forgettable. Nobody else. I used to get so high up for love Now I'm so scared of the distance So won't you show me Show me what I'm missing You wanna be the one you If you do me right This won't be the only night So won't you show me doesn't have the punch in the production and it's not his fault unless he's doing it himself I don't know it's a shame because this feels like it should kick like something from House of Balloons it's very much a weekend track and it just doesn't kick enough and it's just a bit frustrating and disappointing like I keep saying I am enjoying the record I definitely am and we have been spoiled by after hours Listen, the rhythm of his singing here is so good. At the bottom of my cup, only looking for your love. You got me weak, cause you got me weak. You got me weak, you got me weak, cause you got me weak.
Yeah, I did enjoy that track, Weak. Beautiful, soft, gentle track. Didn't have the punch of some of the other tracks, but a nice little palate cleanser almost, and really got to show off his vocal range without really feeling the need to really like blow up with the singing. Very nice track. fucking with this track as well um production wise again listen that one name isn't on this track either i'm going to shut up about it now it will not get mentioned again i hope it hasn't spoiled the reaction we banging on about this because i have really enjoyed this and this is definitely going to be an album that i listen to again it's definitely an artist that i'm interested in it's definitely an artist that i like having another little not quite as good as but thoroughly decent approximation thoroughly decent kind of copy it's a it's ultimately a weekend copy but he's very good at it and so it's just like some extra bonus dlc for after hours by somebody else i'm fine with that yeah another great track this really is a strong project Yeah, another gorgeous track really no complaints here once again just a strong artist totally understand why he's a label mate totally understand why he's in the stable thoroughly enjoyable exactly the type of music that I'm really enjoying right now. As much as I love extremely dense lyrical rap music or, you know, even heavy music, stuff like that, the other stuff that I listen to a lot right now to, to, to soothe the savage beast a little bit, a little bit of calm, a little bit of peace, a little bit of tranquility, a little bit of beauty, that's kind of what I'm in the mood for at the moment and this is definitely hitting for me. Uh, Very nice, very, 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 very nice. Yeah, really enjoyed the project, really strong project throughout. Gorgeous voice, amazing tone to it, amazing rhythm over the songs. And while I did find some of the production a little thin uh, and the choice of percussion a little bit overly simplistic, some of the hi-hats very distracting, I wanna make sure that I'm definitely reiterating the point that that project Dream Awake by Black Atlas is something that I will spin multiple times and enjoyed it very, very, very much. Definitely not on the level of Abel, almost like he's the opening act that you bring out as a stand-up comedian who's good, he's going to get the crowd going, but he's not as good as you. But then again, who is? Who is, realistically? Very, very, very much a very similar artist as well, but exactly what I was kind of in the mood for right now, and a very, very pleasant listen on a Tuesday morning, when I don't know what day it is anymore, who knows? But yeah, really good, looking forward to listening to it again. Really interested in the artist overall and would love to hear him, hopefully in his next project, really go to the next level in terms of the depth of production uh, to, to make music that really, really does justice to some of those arrangements because the arrangements were cool. But as somebody who you know is really into percussion, generally is into drums generally, uh, I would have liked to have heard a bit more some of them just sounded like very basic drum patterns from a drum machine. Regardless, Dream Awake Black Atlas pretty much loved it throughout. Um, not massive fan of the really, really poppy numbers, but there was only a couple of them. The rest of it was very much more after hoursy. It just sounded after hoursy, which is what we want right now, right? Great stuff. Listen, guys, I hope you're staying safe out there. This is a video that was driven by the community. Follow me on social media. Everybody was hitting me up on Twitter. Everybody's hitting me up on Instagram. Everybody's been hitting me up in my comments on YouTube to do this one. So I need your support to, to even if you want to put this on the XO Reddit or something like that, wherever you think that people might get the opportunity to see this video and enjoy this video, if they would, that would be amazing, to be honest, guys. Uh, there's a Patreon link as well if you want to go and support the journey. Uh, it's just down there in the description. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Let's get a like on those videos as well. Aiming for 3K. There's six there. There. Maybe that's a subliminal message. Who knows? Who knows? Maybe I'm that devious. Guys, I'll catch you in the next video. All right, peace.